Yasna 43, translated by Dean Shah J. Irani. <clears throat> happiness be the lot of him who works for the happiness of others. May the Lord grant him health and endurance. For the effort to uphold truth, I behold these very gifts from thee. Mayest thou, through our might, the spirit of right-mindedness, bless me with the perfection of a life guided by the good mind. And may we have the best the Lord bestows. As we strive for enlightened purpose, may we attain it. Through thy most holy spirit, O Mazda, inspire us with truth, revealed through the good mind, and bless us with things good for all the days of a long life. He who teaches others the righteous path of truth and happiness, both in the material world and also the spiritual, the path leading to thy abode, O Ahura, he attains an end better than good. A generous and enlightened helper, a faithful worthy of thee is he, O Mazda. Verily, I regard thee as the holy and powerful benefactor, O Mazda, for thou, be for thou bestoweth upon the righteous as well as the wicked their recompense. From the flaming splendor of thy fire, mighty through Usha, the power of the good mind comes to me, O Mazda. Verily, I believe thee, O Mazda Ahura, to be the supreme benevolent providence, for I beheld thee as the primeval source of creation, for by thy perfect wisdom thou shalt render just recompense for all actions, good to the good, evil to the evil, at the last turning of creation. Then at the last shalt thou come with thy bountiful spirit, O Mazda, with thy sovereign power and with thy good mind, the good mind which brings prosperity to the world. Right dedication shall teach the eternal laws of thy wisdom, the wisdom which none can deceive. Verily I believe thee, O Mazda, as the supreme benevolent providence. When the spirit of the good mind came and asked me, Who art thou? Whose art thou? How dost thou propose to enlighten the people and answer their questionings? I replied, Firstly, I am Zarathustra, a veritable opponent of the evildoer, but a powerful friend of the good am I. So long as I can sing my songs of praise for thee, O Mazda, so long shall I strive to enlighten and awaken all to the realization of thy eternal dominion. Verily, I believe thee, O Mazda Ahura, to be the supreme benevolent providence. When the good mind came to me and asked, What wouldst thou choose? Before thy fire and veneration, I replied, so far as it is in my power, I shall cherish the gift of righteousness. And grant me righteousness, for verily I invoke it of thee. Earnestly I yearn to proceed in life with our might, the spirit of right-mindedness. Teach us how to question thee, for thy answers console us, the answers which lend strength to the leaders in their prayerful wishes. Verily, I believe thee, O Mazda Ahura, to be the supreme benevolent providence. When the good mind came to me with enlightenment, when first I received and became wise with thy words, and though the task be difficult and hardship may come my way, I shall proclaim thy message, which thou declarest to be the best. And when thou didst instruct me in righteousness, Thy command to go forth and proclaim thy revelation was not unheeded, even before the sublime enlightenment coming with thy messenger, Seroshe, bringing us the destiny of our appropriate rewards. Verily, I believe thee, O Mazda Ahura, to be the supreme benevolent providence. When the good mind came to me, ascertaining the aim of my aspiration, grant me what none has yet obtained from thee, the way to a long life of blessed existence for the good creation subject to thy dominion. As the wise and powerful Lord would give to a friend, so give me thy bliss-producing wisdom, O Mazda, endowed with thy authority, 
with thy spirit of righteousness. I stand with all the followers of thy teachings to proclaim the message of thy holy creed. Verily, I believe thee, O Mazda Ahura, to be the supreme benevolent providence. When the good mind came to me and told me assuringly that a reflective, contented mind is the best possession, let not a leader compromise with or propitiate evil doers, for they treat the righteous as enemies. Thus prayers, O Ahura Mazda, Zarathustra, and those who choose to follow thy most benevolent spirit, may righteousness become incarnate in the faithful with enduring vigor. In the resplendence of thy sunlit realms, may Armaite, the spirit of right-mindedness, reside. May it grant recompense to the righteous in accordance with their deeds through the good mind.